about 10 1, 10 1, 6 3 and bell. Officer down, officer down, shots fired at the police. Officer down, bell. Hey guys, Rick Hogg with Warhog Tactical, and I want to talk to you about Aimpoint's new duty RDS. So this basically just came out the other day. Uh, I had a chance to take it out to the range. I just want to talk to you a little bit about what Aimpoint has done with this optic, which I think is absolutely fantastic. So really, first and foremost, you know, you just kind of look at the overall construction of the optic. You can see easy point for your battery. One thing you notice right off the bat is you can see right there, there's no more screws to undo when adjusting your optic. So again, they've got it flush, easy fix there, and then all you need is just your little Allen wrench here to be able to sit there, go right in, and make your adjustments. So nice feature on that. The other thing Aimpoint's done is they've put these caps on there. So again, you can see there's a black one in the front, and then to the rear, they've got this clear one. So again, what this allows you to do is leave your caps on your optic you can leave your optic on all the time. So what they're saying is 30,000 hours with the battery in there on setting seven. So that now if you're a law enforcement officer, you happen to grab this rifle out of the car, you forget to flip up those covers, no problem. You can still mount your rifle, boom, be able to make your shots in that emergency type situation. Key thing is, I did a video on this the other day, quick short and we'll plug it in. Um, in this YouTube one towards the end, it's for emergency situations only. So again, you don't want to run around with this if you don't have to, but again, in that dire distress situation, you grab that rifle, mount and go, that gives you the options. Good rugged construction. You guys can see over on this side here, easy access to your buttons. So again, if I were to sit there and, and I needed to make a quick adjustment, I could super easy just to go higher or lower, whatever the case may be, get back out and I'm right back on my rifle. So again, just looking at this now, kind of remember this configuration right here. So when we look back at something like the T2, you can see you've got to take your caps off in order to make your adjustments when you're zeroing. So just something aim points done with their duty RDS, really looking at law enforcement involved already comes with the mount on there you can see just one simple screw makes your attachments and then oh by the way it mates up perfect with aim points three power if you opt to run that option on there so again take a look at aim point look at their new duty rds site absolutely fantastic in my opinion again i'm not calling this a quote unquote review I'm um, just calling it kind of an overview of the Duty RDS. Again, I've had it two days. Typically from the Warhog tactical side, we're, if you want to say, reviewing equipment for at least 90 days. However, here's the thing. I have run aim points pretty much since 06 on, on my rifles in combat. I would bet my life on these things. I guarantee this thing is going to perform the same. So make sure you guys are uh, checking out Aim point, there are different optics they have out there, whether it's for your rifle, for your pistol. Absolutely fantastic equipment. Don't forget, hit that subscribe button, that like, leave us a rating. Uh, and don't forget, make sure you switch over to warhog.com. Check out our upcoming class schedule. Look forward to seeing you guys out in the range. Train hard, stay safe. Fire, stay off the air. Everybody stay off the air. I got an officer down, 6-3 and bail. Start rolling.